Hey guys, welcome back to Ursus Gaming. This is Kenzie with another episode of Stardew Valley. So let's see, let's go outside real quick. Oh, we got mail. We got mail. Oh, I gotta remember how to play this again. Ah. To our oh, we don't care about Joja Mart or whatever it's called. Scary with them. You know, actually, the other day though, I did see a. I think it was a brand of soda that was like. Joja or Jaja, I don't know, something like that, um, a brand of soda that was called that, and even the, uh, the font on the, the soda kind of reminded me of the same font that's used on the soda cans that are in this game for the Joja soda, and I was like, oh, it's real, <laughs> but yeah, I thought that was kind of interesting, and I, I wonder if it was Joja or Jaja. I'll have to look that up. It's probably pronounced like Yahya or something. Yaya or something like that. Alrighty, so let's finish watering our plants here. And then, so today, I'm debating. So we are, we don't have that much money. Okay, so probably work a little on clearing this out more but also because we don't have we can't go into the mines yet we haven't received like the invitation or whatever to go into the mines although i really would like to go to the mines since a lot of what we need is in there but oh oh well here we go i guess i guess we'll do this Alrighty. oh that's how i did x x is the key It's not that bad. I don't know. I think I think it has some class to it. With the vines growing out of the walls and the roof. Pride and joy of the town. Always bustling with activity. It's not shameful. It's not bad. Goodness. I don't know, I usually see the kids of the town usually hanging out over here and like playing inside of it, so I mean, and I don't really see any of the teenagers except for Sebastian. Sebastian, of course, it's in front of his computer, but everyone else is pretty good about staying outside. Oh, warehouse, oh. Hmm. Also, if you guys would like me to read what they're saying, uh, comment down below and tell me. Uh, I could, if you want me to, or I could just leave it up long enough for you guys to read. I don't know. Whichever you guys would really prefer. I might read it just randomly from time to time. I'm not really sure. What is it? Yeah, see? Yeah. I mean, I know that's not from them, but I'm sure they play in here a lot. I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, honestly. <gasps> little spirit. Little spirit, little spirit. Oh, yeah. So after we see the spirits, that's when we get the invitation from the wizard. Because he's like, you're special. Drink this. And then we go through an Alice in Wonderland trip. I haven't seen that newest Alice in Wonderland movie. I know that came out a while ago, but I haven't seen it. I don't think I saw the first one, the, the remake, I guess, that they did um, in theaters either. I think I waited for that to come out, like, on Redbox. Woo! Redbox or something. It's not a rat. It's a spirit. It's a happy little colorful spirit. So, go back in here. That's not what we wanted. There we go. Okay. So, if I remember, go over in here. Little spirit. And interact with this. Oh, yeah, we can't read it. Oh, no. Can't exit out of that except for doing that. Okay. And then can't read it. So, then tomorrow morning, I think we will be expecting a letter from the Zer Wizard 
from Howl. I need to watch that movie again and read the book again. The book was really good too, although it was quite different from the movie. I don't know which came first though. I'm assuming the movie, because I think that's like Miyazaki's like original story, but I could be very, very wrong. Very, very wrong. What am I doing up here? Oh, I could pick that up. I could do that and I could give it to Linus because I know he's in need of food. Hey buddy, I don't know if you like him, but you're welcome. You're very welcome. Looking out for you, man. Oh, can I go in here? Cause it, oh yeah, because the construction guy was here last time and he's not here anymore, so we can go in here. Cool. This music reminds me of my grandpa. My grandpa's very western cowboy. Like, he watches a lot of westerns and stuff and, I don't know, he's really cool. He does not have an eye patch though. <laughs> or, and he does not have a cape. Oh yeah, I know. I find many things, uh, many a uh, creature and thing down there. Cool, the sword, and then I already have the pickaxe. Cool, I literally forgot I had a pickaxe already. Just killed outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Keep my eye on you, because it's the only eye I have. It's 10 a.m. You know what? Why not? Let's just let's go down here with no food, minimal energy already. Why not? Let's reorganize. How do I work? That's how I do it. So let's move that next to this there. That's better. I should have left my watering hoe down there. Alrighty, so let's do this. See? Yeah, let's see. Uh, I think it's just easier to click. Yep, easier to click. A geode! Where is it? Let's at least get to level... I think it's like every five levels you get the elevator shaft, I think. Could try and get to level ten. I don't think we will though, since we didn't come in here. There it is. Since we didn't come here. There's some copper. There. Cool. Poor sword looks so nasty. Oh, I'll take you. You're a good gift for Sebastian. That'll make him happy. Mm, goodness gracious. I'm just aiming terribly right now. Little slime, little slime. Oh, wait. Oh, that's how I defend. Yeah, take that. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm terrible at this. Oh, ha! Take that! I cannot pick that up. Okay, cool. Oh. I guess, like, the stone will be good. I also need to... No, I probably won't get animals for a little while. I need to start collecting clay anyways and not toss any of it away. Is there anything else up here? I guess I can see if there's anything in the box. Nothing. Okay. And all right. So on to level three. Oh, it's dark, but there is copper. Oh, what is that? Um. Well, shoot. <laughs> yeah. I'll, I guess we'll just leave it. <laughs> I didn't come prepared. This is what happens when you're not prepared. I'd rather have the stone than that. Stone's a good resource. Oh, look at these boxes. Yes. Yes. Oh, that I guess would be good for my energy. Oh, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Um. No, we'll just push on through. Push on through. Should probably kill that. Dang it. Like, it's funny because oh hey look at that it's funny because like majority of my damage is from just freaking walking into it and not actually hitting me alrighty level four almost to level five 
Oh, 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 okay. Alrighty. Yes. I'm getting a lot of copper. It's probably not that much, but I mean, still. Oh, and got another thing. That's cool. I don't really want to mess with you. Little cave thing in my jig. You are in my way, though. Come on. Over here, over here. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Good. Nothing down here, though. And there's nothing over here. So, I guess just. D do, can you hit this? I think I remember, like, you being able to hit this and stuff will come out of it. Never mind. I probably just imagined that. Okay, probably get to the fifth floor and then get out of here since I am. Oh no, there's a geode! Oh well. Alright, since my energy is so low. Alright, I got to the fifth floor. Awesome. Awesome possum. Go down here. It's so beautiful out here. All these cherry trees, cherry blossoms, I think. Yeah. Gorgeous. All of it. Beautiful. Gorgeous. I need to look at the... Oh, that's a rock. I need to look at the birthdays again real quick. I know Lewis, I believe, is the... The first birthday? And I think it's on Sunday. I think if I remember right. Oh. Hey, I forgot your name. Mario. <laughs> I'm a little sore from work yesterday, huh? Where did you work? Do you, Oh, wait. She works at the hospital? Why are you sore? I mean, I guess, like, nurses do have it hard. I work, I work at a hospital, so, I mean, I do know it can be rather... Hey! I got something you like. Yeah, you do. I know you like it. Pam! Pam, Pamela Pam, you're my best friend. Oh, you don't look happy. Oh, no. You don't know. You're fabulous. You don't need to be born rich. Alex? What? Okay. Alrighty. The, uh, everyone's going to the saloon. What's going on in the saloon? What's happening in here? Oh, oh, these guys are all over here. You like cheap sodas, don't you? Yeah, you do. Here you go. Yeah, I know you do. There you go. It is Friday. Although you don't work, so why are you so relieved that it's Friday? None of you work, except for Sebastian. Sebastian works. Because he does, like, coding or something, or I don't know, something with a computer. But other two don't. Uh, let's see. It's already six, so the blacksmith is closed. Um, I guess drop our stuff off, I suppose. I wish we had the hot spring already and to, like, bring, revital, revitalize, re blah, 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 ourselves. That'd be nice. Alright, put all yo away. Actually, do that. I'll refill that first. Um, yeah. There we go. Cool. Refill that. Put that away. I didn't look at the, I didn't look at birthdays. I was just saying I wanted to go look at birthdays, and I did not look at them at all. Alrighty. Probably should go do that. Probably be a good idea. <laughs> Why is there no music playing? Even though, I mean, it's peaceful, but I wouldn't mind some music. I like the music of this game. So it is. Okay, so it is Lewis. Mayor Lewis on Sunday. I need to figure out what he likes. Probably anything. He's probably, like, one of the easiest ones. Besides Pam. Pam's super easy. This is what's-his-face, the blonde who was in the band. Since he, like, you can win him over with just Joja Cola. Uh, Vincent and Haley. Hmm. And then Pam. Absolutely cannot forget Pam's birthday. She, you have to remember her birthday no matter what. Because she's awesome. Well, 
I guess there's nothing really going on. It's already 7.20. I forget how fast this game seems to fly by. Everyone is here. I guess it is Friday night. Look at these two dancing. Look at these two. Aw. How cute. <gasps> it's a bear. I need that in my house. I need that in my house. Can I not interact with it? Oh my gosh, I need this. I need this in my life. I'm sure Zach would love that in the house. Something up here. Oh, it looks like there could be something. Nope, okay. I like how it looks like he's the only one really playing in this bash. He's just standing there. It's like, okay. Maybe I could. I don't know, man. I don't know. I think you're... I think you're okay, because... It really doesn't seem like he's doing anything. Win for once. Oh, are you just that cool that you can, like, do it with your mind? That's it. That's it. He can do it all with his mind. You're the doctor, are you? No, you're Pierre. Pam, you look so sad. Du, 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 du. I like this music. It's just so peppy. Alrighty, I guess we can just go to bed and then start anew and hopefully have that letter in the morning. Yes. Because I don't think there's really anything other else going on. Well, I guess, wait, can I trigger an event now? Okay. I know there's an event you can trigger with Lioness at night when coming into town that happened to me randomly and it's actually really sad. <laughs> Like, I don't know, I thought it was sad at least. Alright, let's go to bed. Because we're lame, everyone adults is out partying. and We're going to go to bed. Oh, and it's raining. Oh, that's nice. Makes my life easier. Let's see, weather report. For tomorrow, it is partially cloudy with a light breeze. Okay, expect lots of pollen. Okay. And the fortune teller somewhat annoyed today so I would not have much luck in the mines okay maybe I'll try oh well hello good morning I'm breaking some rocks and yeah I have I most definitely have oh you're right <laughs> well thank you I greatly appreciate it. I wonder if there's a way to upgrade furnaces. Like, I don't know. I never really... Oh my goodness, I keep yawning. I never really got that far if you could upgrade your furnaces. Because the furnaces took forever, I feel like. Yep. Rasmodius. I did not know that was his name. M. Rasmodius, wizard. I, the, I wonder what the M stands for. Mortimer. We're going with Mortimer. Oh, there's another one. So you've been, if you can slay ten slimes. Okay. Well, I will most definitely try. So what were the blueprints to make a furnace? Let's see. Twenty. Oh, okay. Twenty copper ore. Okay, let's go to the wizard. Why not? Let's go to the wizard. Oh, gosh. Yeah. Yeah, oh no. Here comes wasting all of this. When it could be used for the freaking silo. But I don't have a silo yet, so. We'll just cut down as minimal. As less as we can. Because I don't want to. Oh, this is a mess. I don't know. I like, when I do get a silo, I like having it quite stocked. Oh. Oh. Got an update from Armello, which was a game I wanted like a year or two ago, and now I don't want it anymore, and it still for some reason updates me. Even though it's not on my wish list or anything. Alright, there we go. Um, wizards this way-ish. Yeah. Let's go around this way. Oh, oh, okay. There it is! The wizard tower! 
the wizarding world of M. Rasmodius. I think that's how his name was said. Hey, there we go. Look at that cauldron. Can I move? No, he's talking. Can I move now? No? Okay. <laughs> Seeker of the arcane truths. Aww. I kind of wish they would have made him look like the... I mean, I get this is not Harvest Moon, but it would have been cool if they made him like the wizard from Animal Parade, because I love the wizard from Animal Parade. Even though he was a pain to like, get to and gift. Oh my goodness. You'd like to show me something. Behold! Ah, oh, look at the little spear. Oh! Oh, I forgot how cute those sound. Oh. I kind of feel bad. Like, he has it trapped. That's sad. Let it go. Oh, let it go. And why'd you have it trapped? Unless it wasn't trapped and it was just like, I don't know. It seems like it was calling out for help. <laughs> We don't- I don't have it. I've seen it. I don't have it with me, though. Okay. Oh, <laughs> It's ridiculous. <laughs> just chilling. Oh! Why did he come through the door when he could have just woo, backed in? Hmm. Were you? Were you really? Did you know a happy- we, the Jumino, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of the scroll. See, and I don't feel like the forest is like a big thing like, I don't, in this game. Like, there is one, but like, you don't really go to it that often. I don't know. Run with the forest. It should just be one with nature. I don't know. Are you a granola? If you are a granola, you are qualified for this quest. Granola actually sounds really good right now. I'm hungry. Oh. <laughs> Ingredients from the baby fern, a moss scrub, caramel top toadstool. Yeah, I was, I was going to say caramel top sounds good, but toadstool, I don't know. Can you smell it? I wonder if caramel top toadstools are actually a thing. I'm going to have to look that up. I want to see if that's a thing or not. Shouldn't have done it, girl. I'm going to go down the rabbit hole now. Oh, no! Coming one with the forest. You are slowly turning into a granola. You are slowly Uh, this is kind of trippy, I'm not going to lie. It's kind of messing with my eyes right now. Floating trees. So this way with the floating trees. You've gained power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Jumino scrolls. They weren't really scrolls since they are more like golden plaques that were just set on the floor. Oh, and he kicked me out. Okay. Alright, well... I guess we'll end this episode right here now that we've just been gone down the rabbit hole and became a granola and now are at one with the forest and communicate with the Jumino little spirits. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and be sure to give a like and a subscribe and check out the other videos on Ursus Gaming and check out Zach's videos too. And yeah, you all have a nice day. Bye!